Hello everyone, welcome to day five. Yes, it is day five. Um, so today we're at my desk. I actually made my tripod really little so that I've never had it this small. So I can put it on my desk and I'm gonna do my makeup. And I've been up since three or four. It's currently about six, so I'm getting ready, which I haven't done in a long time. So we're gonna get ready and I'm watching YouTube videos. I'm watching Kayla Nicholson right now and then I'm gonna watch, um, I'll go, I'll go to my subscription box so I can show you because I didn't do it yesterday, which I don't know if you guys care, but I'll do it anyways. Um, so I have to watch Kayla Nicholson's, I have to watch Peter Likes books, um, I have to watch Dylan Reader 5, Peter's vlogs, and then I Love You for books. Those are the most recent videos that are in my subscription box that I do want to watch. Um, not that I have to watch them. <laughs> like I said, I have to, but I want to watch them. So we're going to get ready. I'm just going to watch some videos. <laughs> about seven o'clock and I just got home from school physio and then I went out a little bit because I had to pick up a few things so I thought I'd show you guys some little things that I got if you're interested but some things I can't show <laughs> like I have a gift for my friend I can't show you just in case she watches this which I don't think she will but in case she does I'm literally giving it to her tomorrow so if you guys actually care it's really cool though I think a lot of you guys would be interested in it then I'll show you tomorrow uh, I'll show you, I, I can tell you what it was tomorrow. Um, so I went to Winners. Gotta love Winners. I got a scratch pad for my cat. This is the most interesting part of this haul. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Um, it's literally a scratch board. And then the other side has a rug on it because this guy's been scratching one of our rugs. So we got him this and hopefully he likes it. Um, then this, this is probably something you guys are more interested in. It's a little sticker book. It says meow on it. And it has all this stuff in it. So it has this little envelope thing. It has cat sticky notes. And then it has this little weekly cat thing. Literally perfect for my cat moms. Hey, okay. So I got that from Winners. And then more about a lot of things with Libby and Rose. It's basically like Victoria's Secret style place. It's lingerie, bathing suits, the whole shebang, which I'm not gonna show you like bras and stuff because mm, that's weird. And I don't know. I don't feel like showing that, but I'll show you other stuff. So, so starting off, I got this, which you're probably like, what the fuck is that? Um, basically, I don't know how this works yet, but there's a water bottle thingy in it. You fill this up with boiling hot water <laughs> and you use it as like a heat pad. So you can put it on your stomach if your stomach's sore. Hi boo, I'm filming. You wanna say hi to my vlog? The cat's scratching. Me. Can I take it? You wanna be in my vlog? No. Me. <laughs> and you can put it around your neck, which is what I'm gonna use it for for my neck pain and stuff. So I'm excited to try it and it's a cat, so. Yes, mom! <laughs> Literally me. Um, I also got slippers. 
see this store always has really good deals so if they had like 70 percent off a bunch of stuff so i'm like yes and i returned something that didn't fit so i had like 50 dollars from that but i have these little slippers which i use these so much so i'm gonna use these around winter honestly i'm already thinking ahead to christmas like when halloween is done <gasps> christmas because you think halloween would be my favorite season because i love dark things but it's Christmas has always been my favorite season. Halloween is great, don't get me wrong, but it's not like my favorite, which I know it is for a lot of people, which trust me, I love the creepy vibes, but Christmas is something so special to me. But anyways, enough about that. Um, I also have a kitty mask, which literally my mom was just like, you gotta get this. So I have like five sleeping masks. I don't really use them, <laughs> but maybe I'll start <laughs> using them again. Um, yeah, this one's a cat. It's soft. It's cute. All this is cat stuff. But we have this pajama shirt that says, I like your catitude. <laughs> yes, and it has a cat on it. Okay, you can tell I like cats. Um, and then with that, I got these pajamas, and they have cats on them. <laughs> Surprise! So they're like this, and they have cats. So I haven't read my stories yet today. No shocker there. Honestly, Spookathon is going not exactly as planned, which is fine. I mean, I've had fun vlogging. It's been a good experience for me to get do daily vlogs because I've only ever done them for Booktubeathon. So it's kind of cool to do this, and I like that you guys are enjoying them, and it's cool seeing your feedback and stuff. So I think as the vlogs are going on, and I'm getting a little bit better at adding different things. Um, some days I don't have time to film certain stuff, but definitely I think in the future my vlogs can get really good and they can progress pretty well. But for my reading, I haven't read my stories yet, but I will. And I'm actually enjoying that collection a lot. Like I think it has a lot of different stuff in it and I'm actually very impressed by like the creep factor in them. I'm kind of liking it because I don't know, I didn't expect much from it because it's young adult horror so i'm like it can't be that scary i don't know because even adult like horror never scares me that much or really at all um the only thing that sort of scared me like cr it has some creepy vibes to it but that's about it for me <laughs> um so slasher girls monster boys is like pretty good like i'm liking it so far um then we have the dreadful tale prospering which i've read a chunk of today i think i read 70 80 pages which is pretty good for me today um just considering i didn't really have much time today but i managed to fit in 70 pages which basically i'm not liking it <laughs> like i didn't want to say that because as soon as i'm like oh i'm hating this book or oh i'm not liking this book then it's like even harder for me to finish it i'm gonna finish it like the font is like f pretty big and i kind of want to know what happens but I don't know. I'm not really liking the Dreadful Tale Prosper writing. I think it's kind of bland. I don't think the main character has a lot of substance to him. I think the only interesting thing is like the uncle and then the demon and then that's it. Like the story's pretty bland. The writing is fine. Like I don't know. I'm bored. <laughs> like nothing's happening. And this book is always described as like a kid who has a demon living in him which is how i've always heard it described literally you don't see or hear anything about that till like page 110 and the book is like 350 pages and it's middle grade so you think that would have got introduced sooner into the story um so yeah i'm a little confused about that but i don't know i'm not really liking it but we'll see how it ends up going let me know what you guys read today um i'll see you tomorrow hopefully tomorrow's vlog will be more interesting for you guys i think i'm gonna film i think i'm gonna bring my camera with me and i think i'm gonna film and vlog while i'm out which is something i don't do so we're gonna try it maybe take a risk tomorrow we'll see if i'm feeling it if not i won't know combined saturday sunday vlogs but we'll see what happens let me know down below what you guys want to see but thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you tomorrow bye or the next day bye <laughs>